Hi guys, Miranda Simonick here. I'd like to read you a little book called When I'm Feeling Sad. It's written and illustrated by Trace Maroney. I'm going to try to use my, my bunny voice here. When I'm feeling sad, I feel like someone has taken away all the colors and everything is gray and gloomy and droopy. Oh, poor bunny. I see that. When I am feeling sad, I feel like I could cry and cry and cry so much that I make a flood. Yeah, sometimes we can cry that much or it feels that way. I want to crawl into my bed, pull the covers over my head and stay there until the sadness goes over. Yeah, sometimes it's easy to want to hide from sadness. Some things that make me really sad. I feel sad when I hear my family arguing. Oh, honey. Or I feel sad when I'm sick or don't feel well. Well, that's normal. Anybody's going to feel sad that way. I feel sad when someone or something I love dies. Yes, that is very sad, Mr. Bunny. It's okay to feel sad. Talking to a friend or just letting myself cry can make me feel better. Yes, it is very important to talk to people we love when we feel sad. When I feel sad, I try to be kind and gentle to myself. I like to take a big bubble bath or listen to my favorite music. Wow, Bunny, those are really good ideas to help you feel better. Sometimes I feel better when I'm with my friends or family, even if I don't want to talk. Yeah, sometimes just being around loved ones or knowing they care can make us feel better. But the nicest feeling of all is when a kind person gives me a hug and says everything's gonna be okay. Yes, of course. So I want to ask you though, what happens when you feel sad right now? How are you feeling? And think about that. And what are you doing to cope with those feelings? Because it's important that we use things to make us feel better when we're feeling sad because it's normal to feel sad. But I want each and every single one of you to know that no matter what, it's okay to feel sad and things will be okay.